The government has finally told us when dairies and shops being relentlessly ram-raided will get some support. Help is one or two weeks away, and as Yannicka Torellin reports, it will come in the form of funding for physical protection, like bollards. With his mates lurking down the footpath, the driver of this SUV veers sharply straight into the front door of an Auckland menswear shop. Two strikes in the dead of last night, and they're in. It's a calculated 2am ram raid right in the middle of Panmure that only took one minute. Eight armfuls of brand new clothes worth thousands of dollars, gone. And the shop owner is not insured. Not good. Start getting headaches straight away, you know. It's the specific type of youth crime the government says is getting out of control. Since the latter half of last year, that's when we've suddenly seen this, this spike. So that's why we call it a spike, because you can very clearly see that that's what's happening at the moment. Also overnight, a Glen Innes liquor store was hit just down the road. And further south in Hamilton, a ram raid saw thousands of dollars worth of high-tech winter jackets cleared out. There was disappointment. A large $562 million police funding boost announced yesterday failed to target ram raids. But late this afternoon, a promise the government will soon part fund the installation of bollards or other physical protection for shops. The government can carry um, a part of the cost potentially quite a large part of the cost of installation of those. It's previously helped fund about a 1,000 fog cannons for shop owners. But this time it's looking at bollards. They weren't the perfect answer for this attempted ram raid at a Caltex in Mangere on Saturday night. But the government is keen enough to spend time figuring out the local bylaws. Whether there are alternatives to bollards where you can't use bollards because of that or some other reason, uh, but that is our intention to provide that kind of support. It's promising a targeted announcement within one or two weeks. Back in Panmure, it can't come soon enough for shop owner Vinod Ranchod. He can't afford bollards for his shop, but he's fed up and he's scared. Yannicka Turrell in News Hub.